Hey guys, so I want to talk about Robinhood today. Um, not a sponsor, but <clears throat> excuse me, I'm still dealing with the uh, the smoke inhalation from the Trailblazer, so bear with me, please. But <clears throat> excuse me, uh, Robinhood. If you do not know anything about stocks or cryptocurrency, especially cryptocurrency, please do not put money in until you learn quite a bit about it. I thought I knew quite a bit by going through Robinhood's. Uh, um, files and stuff to, to learn stuff, but apparently I didn't. Um, so the IRS is after me saying that I, I gained $41,000 through cryptocurrency and, uh, they want $7,000 in taxes. And the reality of it is, is that I put in $7,000 from my bank. And when everything was said and done, all the money I gained and all the money I lost, I ended up withdrawing, um, what was it? Six thousand, like one hundred dollars, whatever it was. The, the leftover money, the money that I lost, was nine hundred and thirty-five dollars. That's what I lost. So the original seven thousand, I lost nine thirty-five off of that. And then when I when I withdrew, I withdrew like fifty-one hundred, and then I withdrew nine hundred and fifty, and it ended up being uh, nine seventy-five left over. But or sorry, nine seventy-five was what should have been left over after I pulled that much money out, but all that was left was 40 bucks. So the 975 minus the 40 that was still there, I lost 935. But a Robin Hood apparently reports just your gains. So when you go to, when the IRS looks at it, they're like, oh, he, he gained $41,000 and didn't pay taxes on it. So I had to print out this whole statement. This is my whole year um, <laughs> PDF files I had to print out and uh, I have to send that to the IRS and show them like, no, I did not actually gain $41,000. I did talk to somebody with the IRS and he, they did say that, uh, for some reason, those cryptocurrency companies, they only report the gains. And then, so if you, he's like, if you print out your statements and it shows that you lost money, um, then they'll, they'll deal with it. But I mean, I'm worried about it. So they, they want $7,000. And here's the other thing too, is this is from the tax year 2022. And they sent this to me. I got it last week and, uh, they're charging me a $1,000 fee for having my taxes so far off from what they, their information is. And they also are charging me interest on like the, the, the amount that they say I owe is like 5,000 and change, but they're also charging me interest on the money that I supposedly owe even though they didn't tell me about it for two years. So I gained interest for two years on the $5,000, which comes out to be in, it's like a seven and uh, it was 7% for a little bit and 8% for a little bit. So it comes out to be in like 700 bucks that they're charging me for interest. They never told me that my taxes were weird until, um, for 2022, they never told me until last week to this is, uh, July 29th, I think of, of, uh, let's see, what is it? Uh, July 28th of 24. So it's been accumulating for over two years or sorry, a 2022 would have been 2023. So a year and a half. So sorry, my, my bad. A year and a half is what they didn't tell me for. So if you're using Robin hood, watch it, please do not dabble with cryptocurrency unless you know what you're doing. Um, and I, I mean, I was just, I was running my business at the time and I was home a lot. So I was, uh, I would see Bitcoin going up a little bit. So I'd, I'd sell it cause I'm like, oh, I need the gain here. Oh, it went up a hundred bucks. I'll sell it. Cause I didn't know how much higher it was gonna go. So um, I was gaining a hundred bucks here, gaining a hundred bucks there. But then when I check it, when I'd sleep overnight, I'd get, wake up in the morning, it'd be down like 600 bucks. So I'd lose it all again. So, um, so I have to fight the IRS with this and hopefully the documents that I show will prove that I actually lost the money. And hopefully they're not still after me, even though, because there's still a weird thing where like I put in $4,000, it went up a bit. And then I put in another 2000, it went up, you know, other things went up again, put in another thousand later on. But when I pulled it out, I pulled it out at a different time. So I'm hoping they don't count it as kind of like where I gained $41,000 from the 4,000, <coughs> excuse me. And then pulled out 5,000 and somehow that was part of the 41. So that's why they think I gained it. I don't know. I mean, I don't even know if that even made sense, but, but anyway, uh, please, 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 um, like know what you're doing before you dabble in it. Cause this is a headache for me, but, uh, if you have any questions, comments, leave them down below, <coughs> excuse me.
like I said, this, that stupid smoke inhalation is bugging me. But uh, I will try to answer anything. I'm not, I mean, honestly, I don't know much about um, cryptocurrency. Apparently, I don't at all. <laughs> I thought I knew quite a bit because I was reading through Robin Hood stuff before I messed with anything, but apparently not. So, um, but questions, comments, leave them down below, and thanks for watching.